Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. Um, so this video is going to be about how I organize my binders. So I have two, one for clinical and one for classroom based classes. So the first one that I'm organizing is my clinical one. So the first section is just a bunch of policies. Um, the second one is an example how to document when I'm on the unit and the third section is just a bunch of random papers that I use to document on. Um, and I just keep that in there so I can reference back to it if I have a question on how to document a certain thing or whatever it may be. Um, so I'm just skimming through that and then my little clipboard is what I use to write on when I'm actually on the unit. But um, this binder was actually not as well as I thought it would be, but I thought it'd be really helpful to have a binder for clinical. Um, and right now I'm just sorting through some of the papers. So now that I'm done organizing that binder, I'm going to move on to the next one. So I have about four dividers in there. I do have four classes. So the first one that I typically have in the morning is my arts and science class. The second one would be lab. The third and fourth class are um, nursing research. And the last one is leadership. So right now I'm just trying to organize my arts and science section I know it looks crazy but the stuff that I'm pulling out of that folder that I have right now I really love it and it was super cheap it was like two bucks from Walmart you have a section on the left side and then you have a section on the right side with three dividers so that you can easily organize your things so what I like to do is obviously I haven't been doing it but what I do like to do is that whatever I have going on for that week I will put it in the um, folder in the four different classes that I have and then when I get home I would like to put it in my binder but I didn't have a binder at the beginning of the semester because I was using a um, I guess like a folio kind of thing where you kind of just shove the papers in there but I thought I would get better use out of a binder so I purchased the five star flex binders um, I did have them in high school but I don't know what I did with them so I reordered them off Amazon I will link it down below um, I really love these binders because they're in between a binder and a notebook um, so it's just really nice to write on and easily accessible um, right now you can see that I'm organizing my papers but Please enjoy the rest of the video. If you have any questions, um, leave any comments down below. Thanks, guys.